there is a new text to speech generation model this is dia this is a 1.6 billion parameter text to speech model created by nari labs so this can generate highly realistic dialogue from a transcript you can condition the output on audio enabling emotion and tone control the model can also produce non verbal communications like laughter coughing clear throat etc so let's try out the demo they have comparisons with 11 lab studio and sesame csm 1 billion uh, let's try out the demo first so here is the text i just modified the text a little bit over here by saying wow amazing grunt so there are two speakers okay so this is the text let's hear the audio dia is an open weights text to dialogue model you know what dia might be a good text to speech generation model only 1 billion params wow amazing oh try it now on github or hugging face so the grunt was that a uh, sound over here but this is quite fast speech okay the tone is quite fast over here you can also optionally put an audio prompt over here so maybe let's uh, change this grunt to clear throat let's see what happens over here uh, let's generate the audio so this will take close to 22 seconds for it to generate the audio on this demo page in the meanwhile let's go to the comparison of dia with 11 lab studio and sesame csm 1 billion parameter model so first let's run dia dia is an open weights text to dialogue model you get full control over scripts and voices wow amazing <laughs> try it now on github or hugging face here is amazing. 11 labs uh -huh. try it now on github or hugging face dia is an open weights um text to dialogue model you get full control over scripts and voices wow amazing uh -huh. try it now on github or hugging face so you be the judge of which model is better among these three models i liked dia i liked 11 labs i did not like sesame csm over here so there are further comparisons over here so you can introduce laughs you can you know uh, whereas uh, say 11 labs and sesame models do not have the ability to transcribe laughter tanks into speech we replace laughs with haha Dia is not fine-tuned on a specific voice. It will generate random voices unless you add audio prompts or fix the seed. So here is this input script. Okay. Um, so let's see how all three models perform over here. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. Pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So happy to be speaking to you. Me too. This is some cool stuff, huh? Yeah, I have been reading more about speech generation. Yeah. And it really seems like context is important. Definitely. So let's listen to Eleven Lab Studio. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. Pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So happy to be speaking to you. Me too. This is some cool stuff. Huh? Yeah, I have been reading more about speech generation. Yeah. And it really seems like context is important. Definitely. So here is the Sesame website example. Hey, how are you doing? Pretty good. Pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So happy to be speaking to you. Me too. This is some cool stuff, huh? Yeah. I've been reading more about speech generation. Yeah. And it really seems like context is important. Definitely. Hey. Amazing. Pretty good. Pretty good. What about you? I'm great. So, um... so Sesame website example is uh, Sesame website example is much better than uh, Dia or Eleven Lab Studio over here because probably they use the eight billion version. This is the open sourced or open weights one billion version. I kind of like Dia over here, but the problem with uh, Dia over here is that sometimes the text kind of uh, the basically the words are fast, right? So there are some other fun examples over here. You can go and listen to them. I will not go into them. Okay. There is also an audio prompt option available whereby you can give an input script and you can give an audio. So let's listen to that. Open weights text to dialogue model. You get full control over scripts and voices. So this is the audio prompt. This is the text. So let's see if it conditions over that. I'm biased, but I think we clearly won. Hard to disagree. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for listening to this demo. Try it now on GitHub and Hugging Face. If you liked our model, please give us a star and...
so it kind of gets conditioned on your audio prompt okay but what they're saying is that note that you need to preprint scripts corresponding to the audio prompt in the input to get high quality output they are considering adding a text to speech model to automate the transcription process for easier usage so let's go back to our demo and i just said clear throats right let's listen to this dia is an open weights text to dialogue model you know what dia might be a good text to speech generation model only be 1 billion params wow amazing <clears throat> try it now on github or hugging face yeah so the clear throat i said clear throat right so it got converted into a uh, clearing throat sound so you can also go and install this model locally because it's 1.6 billion parameters. They have given the instructions over here. They've also given that you can use it as a Python library so you can test it out. What they are saying is that uh, DIA has been tested on uh, GPUs. A CPU support is going to be added soon. Uh, on enterprise GPUs, it can generate audio in real time. On older GPUs, it will be slower. Okay. Uh, on an A4000 GPU, DIA roughly generates 40, token, uh, 40 tokens per second, 86 tokens equals one second of audio. So the full version of DIA requires around 10 GB VRAM to use. And in the future, they might, you know, uh, launch quantized versions. That's what they are saying over here. So this is a new, uh, what you call open weights, text to speech model. You can go and try out Daya. You can try out their demo. You can also locally install and try it out. And they say it is competitive with Level Lab Studio and much better than Sesame CSM 1 billion. I hope this video on Daya 1.6 billion is useful to you. See you in another video.